I'm Ann Skinner, and this is Molly McGee, and we're the Skinner team with Keller Williams Realty in beautiful Summit County, Colorado. We're here today just to share a little bit about what's been going on in the Summit County real estate market for October 2018. The information that we'll share with you today is going to cover Frisco, Breckenridge, Dillon, Silverthorne, Keystone, Copper Mountain, and Blue River. And this is coming from the Summit County MLS. We have our own unique MLS and Board of Realtors. So if you're thinking of buying or selling in the mountains, it's important to use a local expert. So in October, we had 218 new properties hit the market. That's quite a bit up from September, which only had 164 properties. That's also quite a bit higher than previous years, so we are going to be keeping an eye on this trend. We had 225 properties actually close in October. That brings us to a total of 1,552 properties that have closed so far in 2018. It's a little below last year where we had about 1,600 properties closed at this time of the year. The average sales price was just over $734,000, which is a little bit of a rebound from the previous month, but still significantly down from our peak selling months, which are, of course, the summer months up here in the mountains. The sales price to list price ratio was, has been holding steady at 97.8% for the last few months. This is indicating to us that buyers normally have just a little bit more negotiation power toward the end of the year. Sellers, on the other hand, are going to have a little bit um, better chance getting close to their asking price during the first few months of the year. So December through May are really the prime months for sellers. This month, the average days on market was 58. That's pretty consistent with what we expected as we saw a few more price drops this month. What that means is properties were listed, they sat on the market for just a little bit longer, didn't sell, and then eventually had to have their price reduced before they sold. But that takes time, however, which increased our overall days on market. Right now, overall, the talk amongst industry professionals is that we are due for a market shift. We are going to start to see some higher interest rates and better buyer conditions while those interest rates are holding near 5%. So while you have that, I recommend that buyers go out there and find the properties that they want. Sellers, if you've been considering selling or upgrading, now might be the best time to do that. The real estate market tends to swing in seven year cycles, which means it goes from about a seven years of seller's market over to seven years of a buyer's market. So now is a great time to try to capitalize on that before we actually see the full on shift to a buyer's market. In addition, the longer you wait, the higher the interest rates are gonna rise and that's gonna reduce the pool of buyers available for your specific property. If you guys have any questions, need more information on these numbers, the local lifestyle or any of our great properties, please feel free to reach out to us. Find us online by searching COMTN Realty.